The result of Erdogan's misadventures is this. Declining foreign reserves, falling exports, a weak currency and growing isolation. That is the description of the Turkish economy for you. Does it sound like a strong nation? A country that can be called an Islamic power because that's how Erdogan would like to describe modern day Turkey. The fact is that the Turkish economy is too weak to support its president's dreams to build a modern day Ottoman Empire. But the president keeps cutting checks that simply do not cash. Our next report tells you how the Turkish economy could break due to Erdogan's many fights. On Tuesday, one headline dominated the front pages of Turkish newspapers. Erdogan calling for a boycott of French goods. At a time when Turkey's economic woes are growing. The Wuhan virus has inflicted deep wounds on Turkey. Just like Europe, Turkey is witnessing a second wave of cases. A few days ago, it reported more than 2,000 new cases. The spike has made investors anxious about the Turkish economy again. They fear that the prospects of a recovery could be fading. How is Erdogan responding to this crisis? By picking more fights with a key European ally, France a fight that could further isolate the Turkish economy. The European Union now believes that Erdogan has contravened the spirit of the trade agreements with the EU with his boycott call against France. Some politicians are calling for a full-blown suspension of the EU customs union with Turkey. That would be an extreme step. But more targeted restrictions on Turkey cannot be ruled out. Like the European Union shutting its doors on Turkish imports. Turkey could lose access to the European market. A major setback for the Turkish economy that was struggling well before the pandemic. Its gross domestic product had dropped by close to $200 billion from $951 billion in 2013 to $754 billion in 2019 in nominal terms. The Wuhan virus made the situation worse. The Turkish economy contracted by close to 10% in August, Turkey's worst year-on-year -year performance in a decade. The voters of Turkey see this slide. Erdogan's party, the AKP, has reportedly lost its popularity. According to a poll in August, support for Erdogan's party had dropped to 31%. This is a major fall. In the 2018 parliamentary elections, Erdogan's party had secured 43% of the vote. How does Erdogan plan to revive his ratings? Not by fixing the economy, but by picking fights with allies and waging proxy battles like the one in Nagorno-Karabakh. He is pushing Islamic issues and driving a campaign against France. All this pushed the lira to record lows against the dollar, forcing Turkish authorities to sell billions of dollars to defend the currency. The result was a major depletion in Turkey's foreign reserves. Erdogan's many campaigns have put more pressure on the Turkish economy. If the Turkish president doesn't pull back now, he could empty his country's coffers. Bureau Report, We On, World is One. Thank you for watching Gravitas on Rion's YouTube channel. If you want to stay up to date with what's happening around the world, then subscribe to our channel and don't forget to like and share. Thank you very much for watching. Rion, world is one.